Yeah. Uh, let's not, let's not embarrass ourselves again. Ooh, an energy bar. Give it to Clementine. Give it to Clementine. Give it to Clementine. She needs food. Here. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. You're of welcome. Course. Of course, I took care of, care of uh, Clement. What's this? Oh, another energy bar. Would you like another energy bar? <gasps> Do you want another energy bar? Oh, I can't give you the energy bar. Oh, what's this? Take battery. Does the uh, the radio needs two batteries, right? Hold on. I need to give uh, I need to give the battery to the woman. I'm pretty sure it required two batteries. Most things require two batteries. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. Sweet. Uh, I want to give the energy bar to the boy, maybe? Let's see. Um, what is this? No, I don't want to open that. Okay, we'll take another energy bar. We can give everyone an energy bar. What? We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. It's not much, but here. For the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. I'm sure he That's does. Sweet Lee. Uh, let's talk to you guys. Hey, Lee. Really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know. You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Anyway, we, Cat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Of course. Uh, how's Duck doing? How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. Little kid. How is she doing? Um, she's good, I think. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What were you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. True. Uh, what's the plan? What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? No. Um... They own this place? They, uh, own this place. They're, uh, gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but, yeah, they're dead. Are you guys alright? Are all you right? guys alright? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Yes, sir. Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. I panicked, you know. I'm not proud of it. Uh, it happens. It happens. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. Yeah, that's rough. I killed that boy. We could have saved him together. You didn't have a choice. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. He saved his son. Try to let it go. He went to save his son rather than the, the other guy. It's, it, pretty much most, most people would do that, right? Oh, man. Tough situations. Tough situations indeed. Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things I'll out there? I'll it now. Um, no, no, no. Greeting cards, I already examined them. Um, do you want a chocolate bar? I'm gonna give you the energy bar. Here, I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't eat it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. I already gave her an energy bar. She doesn't need another one, right? Hey, Carly. Have you got the radio to work? Um, still busted? It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. She didn't even know that there were no batteries in it, so I'm pretty sure we can do better. Nothing. Mm, turn the volume up. Uh, flip it around. Check the batteries. 
Oh, we need more batteries? We need like two more batteries. No? I don't know. Uh, what does this... Antenna. Pull the antenna up. Flip the radio over. Press the power button. Sweet. You fixed it. Continues to spread unchecked. The estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full Such a high tech stick. Uh, uh, my my producer is telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. God bless you all. Okay, there was... There was like a, an office that I could go in. Are you okay? Let's make sure you're okay. I need to keep checking on you. Everything okay? Mm-hmm. Okay, good, great. Um... Okay, let's talk to Lily. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. Who? You're blaming me? You're from here? You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Mm. Was anyone here when you guys got was to the farm? anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. Crap. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. It's excellent. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. I already know what's wrong with him. Can we go to the office? Alive inside? Crap. Well, their bodies aren't in here anymore, are they? Because they, they put them out in case they weren't really dead. Uh oh. This is not going to be good for anybody to see this. I can't think about them in here. Well, first aid kit. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. What do you mean, luck? Oh, well, yeah, I guess. This door leads to the back alley. Okay. The first aid kit. Um, photo. Let's look at the photo. Oh, and that's like what his brother or something. Yeah, his brother. Yeah, his brother. That's right. He's in Macon with his parents. Find anything? Um... Just a picture. Just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. 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 I've been sticking to first names for a reason.
You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. Of course. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Um... Thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Yep, I trust you off the bat, man. I'm just- I trust you, it's fine. I don't believe that you're gonna, like, tell people that I'm a murderer. My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Are you sure you don't need anything in the first aid kit? I don't know if I trust you. <laughs> Aha! Um. Okay, this is a weapon. What's that? This is my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. Okay. Can we take the cane? I get no, we can't? Well... I'd Better get this door clear, huh? I'd like- Can I help? I'd like to take the cane. Sure. I need a weapon. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. How are you doing? How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Optimism is okay. Good. Here we go. Very good. <sighs> <sighs> Optimism will save Do you life. have kids? No. You don't have a family? Um. Uh, what do your parents do? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I, uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. You didn't answer my question. No, I didn't. <laughs> All right, a little further. It wasn't really an option to say, oh, my family worked here. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? Um, because they're dead. Because they're dead. Oh, I'm sorry. You didn't know. It's not your fault. I'm just sorry for being mean. What? You weren't being mean? Look, my family's gone and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got in trouble with keep that I killed someone. I'm not a bad guy. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Oh god. Oh god, now she's bleeding. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. We have a first aid kit, it's fine. I'll find you a bandage. Yep, in the first aid kit. Like a boss, I know where I'm going. First aid kit. <laughs> bandage your up. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. It hurt. Yeah. Let's see if we can do something about it. Um, put a plaster on. Let's it. get this cut covered up. Yes, please. We're building relationships, man. Best relationship builder, NA. Um, I want to open this drawer. There's nothing in there. Lee? 
Yeah. Yeah. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? Um, go find us. They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah. Okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Anything else that I may have missed in this room? Dad kept the remote for that thing in here someplace. Yeah, it's over here. I saw it in the drawer. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Yes, pick up the remote. Use it on the TV. This is like playing Broken Sword. I don't know if any of you played Broken Sword. But it's a similar That's thing. That's what I figured. It's a similar it's a similar type of game. I really, really enjoy Broken Sword and movies like movies? <laughs> Games like that. Should we go? How's your finger? How's your finger? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. That's what I'm here for. Have you heard from Glenn? Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. Everyone out there seem all right to you. Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. I did. Yeah, I did. Can you do that more? Well, I'm not gonna go looking for them. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. Uh, okay. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. What? I think I've got everything in here. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Doors to the pharmacy. Doors to the pharmacy. The door's locked, isn't it? Uh, the keys are on that zombie out on the street. Yeah, I need to go get the. Uh, I need to go get the keys. Okay, let's go back in here. We're gonna see if we can Wanna get the head keys. Back into the drugstore with me. Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? No! I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? Yes. Yes. Yeah, he was. And you had to protect yourself. That's right. Oh, okay. Oh, we kind of told a lie there. Oh, I don't like lying. <laughs> I was just gonna play this and just like tell the truth the entire time. Um, but how can I tell a little girl that, oh, I killed someone because he was boning my wife? Like, she wouldn't understand that. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Yes. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. All right. I meant yes. Yes, no, I do, I do. Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Yes. Let's have a look around. Okay. I need to get the keys from the zombie guy. We have to... Oh, we could have used the cane. No, maybe not the cane. No, we should definitely go go outside. Okay. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. We just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Yeah, but how? Open sesame. That won't work. I was kidding. <laughs> it's universal, but not that universal. <laughs> I know, Doc. Um... I'm the Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? Throw it. It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. That would be a good distraction. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dark nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Now they're gonna go over there 
and then I can go get the keys. Genius. We are genius. I've got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. Okay, we're we're not geniuses. We're, we're not geniuses. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. We need to break the glass. Did you guys try to get in there and Oh, get we weapons? already discussed this. I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up, and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. We already discussed this. Doc, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. Uh, we can go around. It's doing what locks do. A few seconds of searching and we'll know if he has the keys. Yeah, we can't. I don't think we can do anything right now. Those things like TV. Or at least the sound of it. If they were louder, we might be able to clear the street. How are we supposed to make it louder? There must be a way to Those make it. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Yeah, he says behind the glass. Let's we have to be inside. able to break the okay. glass somehow. But we can't get to the street. So, that sucks. Okay, so I need to be able to break the glass. You, woman, have you heard anything? Hey there. Um... You ready to head out? You got it. You? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Where are we going? I'm not even- where- what are we doing? <laughs> I'm agreeing to stuff that I don't understand. This is such a bad idea. <sighs> Didn't anybody wonder where we were going? Did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn! It then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. I agree. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. You have to save... You have to save people. Wait, where are we? Okay. I can't really see anything to cross and stuff. Okay, this is the plan. We don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's boarded up. <laughs> so we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly, noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. 